If you need some extra screen real estate for your iPad Pro and you need it on the go, a portable monitor is the solution for you. And this particular monitor is crazy light. It fits in your backpack with your iPad and the display is absolutely gorgeous. It works great with iPadOS windowing so you can use all the new windowing features in iPadOS 26, including slide over. Hey everyone, Tech Dad here and I had been considering getting a portable monitor to use with my iPad Pro. I have a buddy that swears by it. He takes his everywhere. He takes it to business meetings, to the coffee shop, and everywhere else. Well, the company KYY sent this monitor over for me to try out and test, and I gotta say, this is pretty darn good. I am really impressed with how well this monitor works with my iPad Pro. In fact, this monitor is specifically designed to work with mobile devices. You can even hook this thing up to a Nintendo Switch. So in this video, I want to break down the specs of this monitor. I want to break down your connection options, and then I want to just talk about what it's like to work on a portable monitor with your iPad Pro. All right, let's get into it. All right, so this monitor is a 15.6 inch 4K Ultra HD monitor. It's got an aspect ratio of 16.9, so standard there. Contrast ratio of 1200 to one and 400 nits of brightness, which is about 100 less than the standard iPad. But you can't tell when you look at the screen, especially when you turn on HDR mode, it looks absolutely fantastic. Now, it's got two USB-C ports here on the side and you can use that for connectivity with your iPad Pro, but it also has a little mini HDMI port right here. And this monitor came with all the cables that you need to connect in these various ways. So it came with a USB-C to USB-C, and it came with a mini HDMI to HDMI cable. So if you connect with the USB-C port to your iPad Pro, your iPad will power this monitor, so it doesn't need a power cable attached. If you connect with HDMI, you are gonna need to connect the power cable to this monitor to make it work. Now, the monitor also has a headphone jack, and it has built-in speakers, which I thought were pretty cool. They're pretty on par with the iPad Pro speakers. There are also some buttons on the side to change the monitor settings. Those are really easy to figure out and use. Now, this monitor also comes with a protective case on it, and this protective case also serves as the stand. So the stand can set the monitor into different positions, and then you can easily fold it up and put it away, and it serves as a cover. And like I said, it fits right into my backpack with my iPad Pro and Magic Keyboard, no problem. So I love how super light this monitor is and how amazingly portable it is, which is the whole point, right? The magnets are a little weak in this case, I noticed, but they're still plenty strong enough to hold the monitor up and for it to function. So how does it function with your iPad Pro? Uh, amazing. So the color is really good. When you connect with USB-C, you're going to see things are a little washed out. So you're going to want to go into the settings and go down to your HDR and set it to auto. And then the colors really pop and everything looks as it should. The iPad Pro does really well with the aspect ratio, so it's that 16.9. So nothing looks stretched or ill-proportioned. It looks like it should. HDMI looks just as good, but I like to use that USB-C connection because then the monitor doesn't require power. Your iPad will power it. However, please note that that will drain your battery on your iPad a little bit faster, and that's just what you get for using a portable monitor and powering this device. It's going to happen with any monitor. But the coolest part about it is it's portability. So you can take this monitor anywhere you work. You could set it up in the coffee shop and have two beautiful displays to work on. I took it to Panera and tried it out. It worked great. There was plenty of screen real estate and plenty of space on the table to use this monitor, but it wasn't so big and bulky that it just wasn't workable. It's actually slightly larger than the iPad screen, so I was able to get plenty of windows on there. I could put up two Excel spreadsheets, easy peasy, and even open up a slide over window, no problem. So you're going to get more than double your screen real estate with this monitor and your iPad Pro put together. I have the 13 inch iPad Pro, by the way, and I think it pairs really well with this monitor. The price is also really good on this monitor. So right now on Amazon, this is on sale for $249. I mean, that's pretty darn good, especially for what you're getting here. You got built-in speakers, you got multiple ways to connect. It doesn't need a power source if you connect to the iPad Pro with USB-C. It's super light, super thin. I mean, it's everything an iPad Pro user could ask for in a portable monitor. And now with iPadOS 26 and the new windowing features, man, you can really take advantage of that extra screen real estate. So what I recommend it, Absolutely, especially if you work on the go a lot. I've had a lot of folks on my channel comment about looking for a portable monitor. People definitely take their work on the road or in the airport, and this would be a great addition to your workflow. Let me know if you have questions about this monitor. Leave a comment below. I'm happy to help. I'll leave a link in the description below about this monitor where you can check it out. That's all I got for you. If you like this sort of content, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.